Who brought Mike Parker? Nice, nice to meet you. you. Thank you. So go ahead, guys, if you're ready. How would you describe uh, the way things have gone so far at this point in the season? Um, well, from from our part as a as a family, I think we're doing good. But um, obviously, our record's not showing that. Obviously, but um, I think we have some stuff to work on, and we're not we're not uh, nervous or anything for upcoming upcoming series or anything or later in the season. we we know what we can do, and we're going to stick to that. Beyond the record, what would you say is the most disappointing thing so far? Oof. Um, I think it's just everything's right for us. It's just kind of the mental game and lack of confidence. And I think once we dial that in, then we're going to be really good this year. What about your own level of confidence at making the transition to this level? How do you feel? Right. Well, at first, you know, it's pretty nerve wracking, especially going to Mississippi State in front of those SEC fans and stuff like that. But um, yeah, no. After a few after a few appearances, it gets it gets easier. So um, I'm not nervous at all anymore. My confidence level is pretty high, and um, ready to keep going. How did that Mississippi State atmosphere compare to anything you've done before? Um, that was obviously the most people I've ever performed in front of. You know, it's pretty nerve-wracking when you go up there in front of 15,000 people, all cheer or rooting against you. So, I mean, it wasn't too bad. You kind of just got to have that tunnel vision and focus on on the catcher. And uh, once you do that, then things are pretty smooth. You talk about building that confidence. And how have you got? How has that kind of come along so far? How do you go about doing that? Um, you know, we we um we kind of learn to to do some mental stuff prior to games like um, relaxation and um, kind of meditation and stuff like that with the other coaches and staff so um, I think that's helped me pretty pretty decent amount too so um, yeah I think meditation is probably the best part. Have you done anything like that prior to Oregon State? Uh, no actually I haven't when I first got here they they offered that offered that up we've done some yoga actually out here in center field which is pretty cool but um yeah no this is the first time I've ever done meditation before. How does that help you? Um, it kind of just calms you down. You know, we, we kind of stress about slowing the game down, especially in games. And I think kind of learning about slowing your breathing down and controlling what you can control mm -hmm. is the best part. And um, once you kind of instill that into your mind, then it gets way easier. How have you seen the team navigate? Uh, like, uh, coach is so positive always. Oh, yeah. When you kind of get down a little bit, get down a lot of runs, or you're, you know, record right now how have you seen the team respond to that adversity um well you know we have some people um stepping up and telling us what we need to do mcgarry is a good good influencer and kevin abel is a good good guy for leadership and um you know canham's always there to cheer us up when we need it you know if we're getting rowdy in the dugout he, he'll kind of stay stand to the side and let us do our thing but when we're getting down in the dugout then he'll let us know that we need to keep our intensity up and stay in the game so with McGarry, he's obviously gone off to such a hot start hitting leadership-wise. What does he kind of bring to the table with you guys? Um, well, whenever he comes up to the plate, along with the rest of the family, you know, we're, we're not lacking confidence at all for whoever's up in that batter's box. So I think it's just trusting who's a part of this family and kind of buying into what we have here. What's, is there anything this series coming up that you want to establish? Uh, obviously, first home series, but beyond that, yeah, well, I mean, on the pitching side, um, you know, we're giving up too much walks. And I think that's something we can work on is just pounding the zone, establishing fastballs, and just getting ahead, being aggressive. So. Thanks. Thanks, Thank Gilbert. you. Nice to meet Thank you, guys. Thank you.